It's 12.10. Uh, P.M. October 19th. Like I was saying, now it's in the kitchen. Well, this one, what I was saying, I was saying something else about Key point. These people have no foot to stand on. They have no right to attempt murder on an American for, or his family for his own money, property, ideas, or gifts that were left to him. And they have no right to steal my creations. These people are thugs. They became murderers and tried to murder me for my own ideas, property. My own ideas and property and money that was gifts that I didn't even know about. It. They tried to murder me for compensation that was supposedly set up for me that I didn't even know about. They became terrorists. For money and property that wasn't theirs. They had no right. There's no justification to become a terrorist because you want to steal money and property and ideas that aren't yours. These people are crazy and they need to go to prison no matter how you slice it. You can't just see money and property or opportunity for someone else and then become a terrorist and start trying to murder and kill innocent people for money and property that's not yours and, and then become a terrorist and start manufacturing weapons and WMD so you can steal money and property that's not yours. It's illegal. So why aren't these guys in prison? That's what it boils down to. These people saw money and property that was mine and opportunity. And they became terrorists and murderers and tried to murder me and my family and at least murder me and others for money and property that wasn't theirs and also became terrorists in the process. For money and property and things that were never theirs. Who's allowing this and why aren't they in prison? Let's wake up. You know, I can't just see some kid and be like, oh, he's going to have all these money and all these opportunities and property. I'm just going to make up some lies to justify trying to murder him and kill him and becoming a terrorist when the real truth is it's really just greed and jealousy and I just want to steal what's not mine. Let's wake up. Who's falling for these guys? Bullshit. It's scary now. Only a fucking moron would fall for it. Only someone with more than inhuman stupidity would fall for their fake justifications for their crimes. Only someone with the analytical skills of a two-year-old. Only someone with psychiatric illness or only someone with zero credibility who's probably involved with them. Because, no, you can't see someone who's going to receive money, property, opportunity, whatever, and then become a terrorist and a murderer and try to murder him for it and then make up slanderous justifications and illegal justifications for stealing, trying to steal his money or stealing it, and then becoming a terrorist in the process. There's no justification. It's against the law. You can't just pretend to be a vigilante, even though you're a terrorist and a criminal involved in mafia-like crimes, and then claim you're righteous either. That's illegal, too. So why aren't these guys in prison? Let's wake up.